partners and allies that everything is on the table, including cutting ties. If oh, yes, president. yes. That's what David Moro and Higa used to say. Do you not saying. think that would have a massive negative impact on our country, our economy, our development? Imagine you are a nation called Simiriti and you are holding 10 trillion that is supposed to be Kenyan money. You know it. What then can we talk about rights, human rights? What more human rights? We are not in a state of war as a nation. Surpasses you are saying, look here, Kenya. There are these individuals, one, two, three, four, who are holding your money. We have traced it using the various instruments, uh, using the various secret agents and other, and we know it is part of this. I mean, like for instance, and it must be common knowledge, there are nations right now that have come with laws. If you take money out there, and you are not able to tell who it is. It is appropriated that nation, by that nation, and used for development. Including Kenyan wealth is being used to develop other nations. It is immoral. It is wrong. You, you are not a friend of Kenya mm -hmm. if you are using Kenyan money to develop your nation. Kenyans are suffering now. They need their money back. Bring our money back is a campaign. Whichever country it is, including the U.S., the United Kingdom, you're telling them tonight, you'll go for them. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. 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 Everybody. Everybody. You are holding our money. The nations you have mentioned have brought democracy to us. They have done a lot of good things to us. But you know what? I am telling you 99% of them have wanted to. What we have missed in this nation is a leadership is goodwill. It's a leadership says, let's do it. This country will not be the same five years down the line. This nation will be a nation where you will want to invest in. This nation has that potential. It's a time. It's a season. That's what I'm saying. I am actually passing a message to them.